See the sky. They're still working on the new plate. I don't like this part of Midgar. Back when they were still building Midgar, there was an accident, and the plate fell. People had only just started moving in, so there weren't a lot living there at the time, but... And that's? The underside of Sector 6, Wall Market. A real special place. But I'm sure you already knew that, right? I didn't tell you? I enlisted pretty much right after I left home. I don't know much about this place, or any of the slums. Well, it took a lot of people to build Midgar, and they all needed to blow off steam. So some traders built an entertainment district. Inns, shops, bars, the works. Folks started pouring in from all over. Business was booming, money was flowing, which attracted the attention of some guys who didn't much care for the law. Now there isn't any. Right. But instead of trying to solve the problem, the government decided which to just wall it in. And that's how Wall Market began. Out of sight, out of mind, as the old saying goes. For the folks in charge, there's no better way to deal with it. So it's like a giant veil. Yeah. Wanna see what's behind it? Not really. That's good. Because I know a better way to get to Sector 7. One that, tragically, doesn't go through Wall Market. And it's just through this tunnel here. At least it was, back when I was a kid. It's been like this, you know, ever since the plate fell. And there's no other way? It'll be an adventure. We'll keep it together. So it's my turn? <laughs> And you're going? Dead. 
Don't overdo it. I'll take care of them. Don't you think? Uh... Oh, great. Someone's pulled up the ladder. Idea. I'll hop on and you give me a ride. You serious? Absolutely. I'll throw down the ladder for you to climb up after. Someone blocked it off. 
Because of all the monsters that kept showing up. Pretty dangerous place for kids to play. Raised in the slums, remember? You're tough. Hmm, that's supposed to be a compliment? Try to stay behind me. That way I can cover your back. Looks like a dead end. I'm pretty good at protecting myself, you know. Ah! Oh. 
I bet you can grab that container with the arm. Is a crane operator or something? Yeah? Huh? Uh, hmm. Oh no, look. Why is it always gotta be so tough? Lucky for me, you'll make this easier. Yes, ma'am. Well then, I'm gonna head down. a second. Gotcha.
Okay, right there. Hold on while I drop the ladder. Jumping's not an option, that's for sure. Hmm. Look. Hmm? Someone made a campfire. They found a way down. So can we. I'll protect you. I'm pretty good at protecting myself, you know. <laughs> Too fast, okay? Got it.
Anybody around? Guess it's just us. Hmm. It's still warm. Should we relight it? Have our own campfire? I need to get back. Besides... Looky here, boys! Caught us some burglars! Coming into our homes and stealing our shit! Doing crimes! <laughs> I'd say we're owed compensatory damages! <laughs> Campermen are composite! I don't get it! Ah. How stupid can you be? It's crazy simple. <laughs> Compensatory damages is like, uh, it's like compensation for damages. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's what you get when you, no, when somebody else. We uh, haven't done anything wrong. Yeah, we were just passing through. Oh, a likely story. <laughs> okay, what do you want? Nothing but our due recompense, that's all. <laughs> due recompense, due recompense, due, due recompense? No, no shit, for brains, due recompense. It's like, uh, uh it's like, uh, 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 damages. Oh, uh, of course, so recompense. I can't <laughs> enforce that. I think we've heard enough. Don't overdo it. I'll show you what I can do. <laughs> Is your going? We mean my turn. <laughs> Don't leave me, I'm coming!
Random question, but why did you quit being a soldier? That is random. You don't have to tell me if you don't want to. Uh. Um, did you have any soldier friends? Any war buddies? No. Not really. Oh, okay. Huh? What we got here? <laughs> The ladders always out of reach. Okay, Cloud, heading down. You're in charge of the arm. Got it? Gotcha.
down for you in a sec. That went pretty well. Sure did. <laughs> uh. Huh? Wait a minute. Did you just... Nope. Don't worry. We'll be on the same page next time. What are you talking about? I'm sorry, okay? Hold it right there, <laughs> birds! <laughs> If you want to pass through our territory, then you got to pay the toll! I'm coming! One more shot! Let's go! All right, 
There it is. The gate to Sector 7. Looks shut. How do we open it? More importantly, how about we take a break? Sound good? No. I don't have time Up for- Up there looks nice. <sighs> Come on! You know, a long time ago, I used to sell flowers here. Oh, yeah? <sighs> so, Cloud, you were a soldier first class, right? Yeah. Weird. Really? What's weird about it? Nothing. Just that you were the same rank. Huh? As who? The first guy I ever loved. <sighs> What's his name? I probably know him. Because of the Mako. All soldiers have them. Yeah, I know. Sorry, I'm bumming you out. We should go. <clears throat> Gotta look forward, not back. Won't take long. <sighs> Ready. <sighs> Want to get to Sector Seven in style? This is the passageway for you. getting home and if I said I wasn't I'll go with you I thought you needed to get back <laughs> don't worry I have a backup route for emergencies and it's safer too <laughs> guess this is it then yeah. going on? Shh. I'll explain everything later. But now I'm on my way to see Don Corneo. 
You should head back to Seventh Heaven, meet up with the gang. But... I'll be fine. You've seen how much ass I can kick? I have. <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Oh, no you don't. You're going after her. She's a big girl. She can handle the likes of him. And worse. Uh-uh. You don't know, Corneo. It doesn't matter how strong or smart you think you are. He'll find a way to turn it against you. And where is she going to meet him? A mansion filled with his goons. Come on. Aren't you worried what might happen in there? You have to help her. Come on! Okay. Come on, Cloud! We gotta hurry! to a girl earlier. Do you have any idea where she went? No, and if you don't need a ride, then get the hell out of here. Can't you see I'm trying to work? Can't say I can, no. What'd you say to me, you little... <laughs> What's all the ruckus out here? Hmm. I don't know you. What's your story? We're looking for a girl who took one of your carriages. Can you help us find her? Depends. What do you want with this girl of yours? Guess. We want to save... Save her from a life without this handsome guy. Huh? So, that's how it is, huh? Well, I get a lot of customers. Hard to keep track of them all. This girl, what's she look like? Well... She's in great shape. Is that really important? Wait a minute. You talking about Tifa? That's her. <laughs> oh, looks like someone's got a bit of a crush. Hate to break your heart, kid, but it's gonna be a long while before she sees the light of day again. What do you mean? She's a real pretty girl. Corneo's hosting another audition, and Tifa was chosen as a candidate. An audition for what? For the title of the next Mrs. Corneo. She's what he likes all rolled into one sweet package. Having scouted girls for so long, I know his taste better than my own. And considering those tastes, I can guarantee you this. She won't be walking out of that mansion anytime soon. If at all. So where can we find this Don Corneo? <laughs> what are you asking for? Thinking of raising holy hell or something? Do what you gotta, but leave me out of it. I told you what you want to know. Now take a walk. Oh, and there goes our best lead yet. <laughs> Maybe we'll have better luck in town. Let's check it out. Welcome to Wall Market, the pleasure capital of Midgar that's got everything for everybody. Couple, huh? It's all good. Play together, do your own thing, earn a little scratch on the side even. Whatever you're into, we got you. Got a special one-time limited offer. No, thank you. Come on, Cloud. Let's go.
Oh my god. From all over, come here for. Get hey there! Weapons. We're a pharmacy, but we stock other stuff. Thanks a bunch! I have a decent selection. Take a look, why don't you? Wherever my research leads me, but the success of my endeavors rests entirely upon you. Your assistance would be much appreciated. Cloud! I have come up with the most fascinating theory. Cloud, I've registered a new summons battle intel request. Please, I need you to defeat the summon entity so I can complete the material. Developed a new material. I look forward to receiving all of your future.
I hope you will continue to help me gather vital information from my research. Then I invite you to ready your portable battle simulator. Come <laughs> on! 
Hold me back. Ready. Work, Cloud. This is incontrovertible proof that the universe has a sense of humor. Now that you have a fun new partner in Fat Chocobo, you can work together to squash Shinra like a bug. to receiving all of your future battle intel. I hope you will continue to help me gather vital information from my research. I look forward to receiving... You're gonna love!
Think you're too good for my... But what's it made of? I can only mean right. Warmth, relaxation, the sweet embrace of oh, pretty man. ladies. Machine Records a while back, but I'm still looking for my first big hit. It's been seven years now. Not easy, but you gotta do it. This is a new song of mine. Maybe it'll be that number one. Welcome to Walmart's premier weapon shop. Do come again.
feel so alive. Yeah. Yeah. Excuse me, sir. If you like, you can have it. Ugh. People like him are the worst. It's like, excuse me? I don't care. No, that's not. I'm here for some good old jump time. Yeah! 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 Give it to me, please. I'm begging you, miss. Get away from me before I scream. Like I give a shit! That candy that comes with the summoning materia ice cream. You have an exemplar, don't you? You have to give it to me. That girl? Who has hope standing in the tree? Only a select few even know it. Hands down. Enter or not to enter. You totally get where I'm coming from, right? <laughs> I knew it! Let me guess. After you've had your fun, you fall into a spiral of shame and self- But it only lasts a moment, doesn't it? Next thing you know, you're right back here again. Huh? Got a question for me? Seen Tifa around? Tifa? My love? My light? Who are you and how do you know her? No, shut up. I don't care. Tifa's here? Why? Tell me why! Oh God, no. I did this to her, didn't I? She came looking for me to beg me not to leave her. <gasps> Snap out of it, Johnny. Your Tifa needs you. Tifa, I'm coming, baby. Who was that? Nobody you want or need to know. Aren't you that leaf house? Uh, hey! What the hell, Merc? Digging into people's personal affairs in this town is a huge no-no. What are you doing here? Uh, well, if you must know, I come here at night to live. <laughs> I'd appreciate it if you didn't tell the children, okay? I've always wanted to dance for a living. Stay sharp, though. Lifetime bands are lifetime bands.
You tried your seasonal hmm. stuff? I feel rejuvenated. Check it out. Uh... I think we might have found our man. And he's a gaudy one. Yeah. Not so fast, buddy. Back it up. Got no need for pretty boys here. We're looking for someone. Let me guess. First time in Walmart, kid. Yeah? So? So people can't just walk through the Don's front door. Especially men. How about me, then? Can I go inside? Maybe. But you're gonna wish you didn't. You know Leslie? She's kinda cute! Homely, but cute. Excuse you? Kinda cute's not gonna cut it. Come on. Can't you help us out? Do you have any idea what you're getting yourself into? Aerith. Seriously, Les, she's not half bad. With a little work, I bet she'd clean up real nice. Cloud, requesting permission to kill. Denied. If you're really sure you want to join an audition, then you're gonna need to get official approval. And who can give us that? The trio. 
the only ones in town who are considered authorities on Corneo's particular tastes. First, there's Chocobo Sam, and then there's Madame M over at the massage parlor. Last but not least, there's the Honeybee Inn's Andrea Rodea. They're an eccentric bunch, to put it mildly. And you should know they don't recommend just any girl stupid enough to come knocking. Hmm. Duly noted. Thanks for the info. We'll be back soon. Aerith, you sure about this? If you've got any better ideas... Not really. So that's the way it is. Mm. Tifa's been invited into the Don's estate. Huh? But, to earn such a privilege, you must first win the approval of one of the trio. Right? Meaning, I now know what I must do to save her. Stay strong, Tifa! Help is on the way! Johnny's coming, baby! <laughs> Not the sharpest tool in the shed, is he? Nope. Trio, right? I want you to get me into the audition. Huh? Pretty, please? Why not? Really? Sure. Next time an audition comes around, I'll put your name in the hat. Next time will be too late. Can't you get me into this one? You want in now? No can do, sweetheart. Hardy recommended Tifa, and she's got this in the bag. How can you be so sure Corneo will pick Tifa? You never know, he might pick me. Damn, you really do want in, don't you? Sure do. Then how's about we play for it? Call it, Missy. Head or tail? Yes, right, and I'll grant you your wish. <sighs> Guess wrong, and you'll leave me in peace. No thanks. Oh, not a gambler, huh? I am! Heads! Huh? Hmm? Hmm. Try convincing one of the other two. That's why it's a trio, not just the Mio. Now skedaddle. Wait. Mind if I see that coin of yours? Hmm. 
trick coin. I had a hunch. That's cheating! And that's the wall market way. Lesson learned. Still cheating. Right wrong with it. That Place. was the best thing that's ever been done to me. My sweet, sweet Madam M. I'm a customer for life. I guess they're closed right now. Oh, this is it. Keep pulsing from my fingertips. For God's sake, who does that? Is this supposed to go down like this? I think so. Uh, Let me handle this. See Andrea. You wait out here, okay? And why would I do that? Like, no, I'm coming with. I'm not really sure that... You're a man of many talents, but talking isn't one of them. Welcome to the heart and soul of Wall Market, the Honey Bee Inn. Is there a honey boy or girl whose company you desire? Uh, we're here to see Andrea Rodea. Ah, the shining star of the Honey Bee Inn. Now, are you the one who made the appointment, sir? Can I have your name? Oh, we don't have an appointment. I see. I'm terribly sorry, sir. An appointment is required. And the earliest available slot is three years from now. Three years?! All we want is five minutes. He can spare that. I need his help for the Corneo audition. Yes. Well, regardless of the circumstances, you cannot meet him without an appointment. Is there really no other way? It is rare, but Mr. Rodea does occasionally extend invitations to individuals. Otherwise, I'm sorry, but there really is nothing. I guess that's that then. Oh, well, let's try someone else. Hey, are you nervous too? I know why you're here. To gawk at the honey grape. Yeah. 
Welcome, welcome. Just the two of you? Step right up. Now then, what manner of massage do you desire? Say what? Is this your first time in our establishment? Mm hmm We are a hand massage parlor. An excess of fatigue and tension can make even the simplest task a terrible strain. It is our pleasure to relieve our patrons of that tension. <laughs> And what better way to seek relief than through the skilled ministrations of a professional? So now that we understand each other, what manner of massage do you desire? We're not customers. Then you are... Hoping you can help us get an invite to an audition with oh, Don... Oh, love Say another word and I'll shove this fan right down your throat. Oh. Uh. Ugh, this is the last thing I need. You're young and stupid, and I suppose that means you think I'll let you off easy. So, you want what? A favor? Well, here's the thing. This is a massage parlor, a respectable establishment. But if you don't require our services... Then tell me! Is there any reason I shouldn't have you dragged outside and shot for wasting my valuable time? Well... Hmm... Name? Cloud Strife. Hand. Huh? Give it to me! The strong, firm hands of a fighter. Yet they possess a certain elegance and grace. Okay, Cloud. Let's see what you're made of. After that, we'll talk. So, which course will it be? <laughs> then make your way to the room in the back and wait. Cloud? <laughs> this exclusive treatment is reserved for our most well-to-do patrons. First, the hand cream. A generous coating for each and every one of your richly deserving fingers. Let's start with the tips. That's it. Relax. I'm only here to help. Oh, oh. oh did that hurt? No. <laughs> then I'll move on to the base of the fingers. Let's see if we can't improve your circulation and get that blood flowing. No, don't fight it. Stress is poison to the body. And finally, some gentle stimulation for the palm. No more than a touch. Just like this. Oh, what was that? A cry of pleasure? Is this how you like it? How about this? Or maybe this? <laughs> That was to your liking. Do come again. Right. <sighs> How was it? Huh? You okay? Yeah. <sighs> You're acting weird, Cloud. I am? Really weird. Hmm. Think you'll make a habit of it? All right, 
spent. I think I've seen everything I need to see. So? Tell me what you want, and we'll take it from there. You're one of the trio, right? I want to get into Corneo's next audition. And why in the world would you want to do that? Hmm... Okay. Really? But you cannot go dressed like that. Huh? I could never send Corneo a candidate for in such a plain-looking getup. Doing so would call my position as one of the trio into question. Is something wrong with my outfit? It's comfortable, isn't it? Cloud the fashion critic. Look, just take it outside the parlor, would you? Sorry, we'll stop. So, what should I do about the outfit? <laughs> you just leave that to me. I'll put you in a dress so fabulous, you'll look like a million gill. So long as you can afford it. How much? What I said. But don't worry. It's obvious you can't afford a dress with that kind of price tag. So listen, I have an idea. Uh. There's an underground coliseum in this town. Up for a fight, Cloud? Good. Because I'm getting you into that arena. If you win the tournament, I'll transform Aerith into a drop-dead gorgeous beauty. Is there any prize money? <laughs> yes. For the person who got you in. So... What do you say? All right. That's what I like to hear. They're already letting fighters inside. You should hurry. Run along. What have we gotten ourselves into? Nothing done. good. I wouldn't expect a fair fight in this town. Think we can win it all? That's one thing I'm definitely sure of. I appreciate the confidence, just don't get too cocky, okay? What's this? You're here to compete? <laughs> I hope you know you're cutting it really close. So, the two of you are a team. Yes, the two of us are a team. I need to get into that audition, but I won't let anyone else fight my battles for. Alright, team it is. Head to the waiting area down below. Down, down, down we go. So, how deep does this thing go, you think? I wonder how many people are fighting. Hey, you're not nervous, are you? Nope. Really? You're even more quiet than usual. Just trying to focus, like you should.
in the city that never sleeps. In the paradise of debauchery, it's in the pain and pleasure. Where your every desire can be indulged for the right price. All money. To you, a Dean Panasu of the chaos and bloodshed, we bid you the warmest of welcome. Are you sitting comfortably? Or tonight, the most gruesome spectacle anywhere in Walmart or beyond shall be yours to witness here in the Corneo Coliseum! Tonight's grand prize is no less than one million gil, and there's only one way to get it. Brutalize your opponents, utterly and utterly, viciously, without mercy, until they vomit blood. Only the most ruthless fighters, the savages still standing here at the end, shall claim the skill and the glory. And now, the long-awaited event in which the Blood Star Feast will battle for your amusement, and bonus! Warriors of every shape and size will fight to the death before your very eyes! In tonight's Corneo Time! Wow, this place is really something. <laughs> uh, it's not your turn yet. Your names will be announced over the speaker. Just wait. Oh. <laughs> you again. Ouch, what happened to your face? I just needed a little scratch, you know? So, I signed up for the preliminaries, and... Well... I hope you guys realize what you're getting into. I don't want to scare you, but... If you can make a run for it, you should. Cloud and Aaron, your match will begin shortly. Please make your way to the gate. We're in way too deep to back out now. It's a gift from Don Corneo. Drink it, and they say you'll be raring to go for hours on end. If I had, maybe things would have gone differently for me. Maybe you should. It's yours if you want. How is it? It's thick. But you like it so much you couldn't possibly share, right? You two ready? Try not to get yourselves killed. For our next match, we welcome two fighters, a young couple no less. Talking about a bad day? This is their first tournament, the bad first date, and most likely their last, inexperienced as they are. Or are they? Give it up for Cloud and Eric! Shit. What's up with the pole? Gonna do a little dance for us, baby girl? Okay, now I'm mad. Jennifer, what if Walmart gets home? A renowned master of beasts! Will his pet make a meal of our two challenges to the poor very eyes? They've already been given their appetizers! Their hunger for flesh and fear is unquenchable! The demon talks of hell! The sanguine stalker! You brought animals? Oh, first timers, huh? There's no rule that says you gotta fight man to man. We're in for a treat, ladies and gentlemen. Who will prevail in this total contest between man and beast? This could be over in an instant, so don't even blink. Without further ado, the fourth match of the first round begins now! I'll show you what I can do. This one 
one's for you! Let's start with... My turn. don't make sense. Yeah, true. But maybe it'll be better in the next match? Nah. Wouldn't bet on it. Better to expect the worst. Well, that was some bullshit. Cloud and Aaron. Your match That's what they call me. Ready to rock? Please make your Just way remember, to try not to die. For the second match in our spectacular semifinals, fresh from their first date with death, I present the lucky couple. We're like unlucky for the rest of us. Give it up once again for Cloud and Eric. Thieves and killers through and through. Two criminal for common criminals. The worst of the worst. Ladies and gentlemen, check their pockets because they may have already robbed your blind. The most contemptible sons of bitches inside of Walmart Best benefits. It's those guys. of the Corneo Cup semi-finals. Begin now! Deal with that. I'll show you what I can do. Here it comes! And you're going... Mean! Get him! I'll take care of him! One more shot! Can you take over for me? So it's my turn? You jittery? 
I got you. Get ready. Get ready. Get ready. Get ready. Get ready. I did give him a massage, you know. His palm told quite the tale. He's cheated death more than a few times. Hmm. So have half the people in this town. Anyway, we're both still alive. Call it. <sighs> there you go again. One of these days, your luck is going to run out. When I fall for grace. Maybe I'll land in your parlor once more. <clears throat> that is one mistake I will never repeat. <laughs> you gotta admit, Andy, the way he moves is totally amazing! Andy! <sighs> Next up, the big finale. Yeah. I thought you'd be happier. Just thinking about what we might face next. But you know, we've made it this far. I'm sure we can handle anything they throw at us. Prove me wrong. You guys, it's the final match. Please make your way to the. I've got a lot of money riding on you two. Win it for me. Ladies and gentlemen, our time together is almost over. Tonight's thrilling Cornell Cup, filled with unprecedented upsets and drama, has only one match to go. <laughs> we know. We're just as disappointed as you are. But ladies and gentlemen, all good things must come to an end. So let's celebrate by getting so damn loud, they'll hear us up on the play! Yeah! Come on! Once more, the sweethearts would surprise us with upset after spectacular upset. The power couple with the boundless love for bloodshed. The champions of Madame M, Cloud and Eric! Champions, Cutty and Sweepy! 
rather well. I was looking forward to a little temper tantrum. You bet it all on a toss. Sometimes you get burned by Lady Luck. Every coin has two sides. You're right, of course. Even if they are both the same. <laughs> Later. And now... I believe I have a prize to collect. Sorry. The madam will have to wait. The Don's demanding that we tack on one more match, it seems. What? If they win out, then you get paid in full. Now hold on just a goddamn minute! His call, not mine. <laughs> now that that's over, we can go save Tifa. So we'll head back to Madam M's. Get you changed. Right. Sorry to be the bearer of bad news, but you still have one fight left. What do you mean? The crowd loved your show a little too much. People are placing hefty bets, much heftier than you can pop. Corneo's going to milk this for as much as he can. Meaning what? You face and defeat Corneo's fighter of choice, and only then will you be declared... Hey, that wasn't the deal! Don't you think I know that?! You greedy bastard! Scum-sucking piece of shit-festering asshole! Uh... <sighs> but that's the way it is. Corne but if you win this match, Corneo will have to accept your victory, and the crowd will make sure- So this is the last one? <laughs> I sure hope so.
Go on now. That prize money is going to pay for your dress. Watching you guys fight gave me goosebumps. Hope your next match is even better. Ready to kick at? It's not even about the money anymore, man. I just want you guys to win it all. Show them what you got. Tonight's Corneo Cup has been a spectacle like no other. And we shared your disappointment, ladies and gentlemen, when we told you that it was coming to an end. But nobody felt it more keenly than one time Corneo, who has decided that a bonus match is in order. Participating in this match will be this evening's leading lights, the dynamic duo that has crushed all competition thus far, Klaus and Eric! An unspeakable horror, long in prison, set free tonight for your entertainment! The secret star of Don Corneo's stellar stable! Enter the Hell House! Stay strong, okay? It's the hell! Oh, that's not the 
look at Chloe Kent. What kind of party is it? I don't know, but I'm glad I wasn't invited. Run her up. Oh, 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 oh! And it's a stunning critical damage! Now, that comes! No, not yet. <sighs> Ladies and gentlemen, what is happening? What the? Look out!
deal with that. I'll take care of them. First thing.
is on you. I'll take care of them. The crowd is going wild! I know that the crowd is gonna bring this out! Go on! It's your turn. Take it over.
It's your turn. My turn. Keep it together. Here goes. Tagging out. Hey, back. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Look at this. All right. Hey, hold on. I'm coming. in some way. What will you do? There you are. I've been looking for you two. So Madam M wanted me to give you a message. She says you guys did pretty damn good and that you should swing by her shop when I was also hoping you might be interested in a few more matches here at the Collis. Big events like the Corneo Cup are pretty sporadic, but there's always that. gather vital information from my research. I look forward to receiving all of your future Talking to you, I sent their clothes. You're here. 
Good. I have everything I need to get started. Just one thing before we do. You're the Cloud, right? Cloud the Merc. I'm told you did a wonderful job helping the people of Sector 5. <laughs> you have a very impressive work ethic. It's like they say, good things come to those who work. What goes around comes around, and in ways that might surprise you. <laughs> I'm going to put Aerith in the most gorgeous dress you've ever seen. <laughs> It'll be a real jaw-dropper. All right, now that that's out of the way, once you change, you won't be able to leave town. Are you sure you're ready? All right, then. Let's get started. Beauty takes a lot of work and preparation. Far more than you'd know. In the meantime, let me see, let me think. There ought to be things you can only do without your friend. Now's your chance to get out and have some fun. <laughs> I can tell you're already beginning to feel at home here. Though being so new to it, I assumed you still wouldn't know how to enjoy yourself properly. <laughs> so I went and had a chat with Sam. He said he'd be happy to help you out. Hey, no one asked you to do that. But there's so much you don't know. This is the perfect opportunity for you to learn the ways of the world and man the hell up. And that's enough of that. Aerith, come with me. Oh boy, I can't wait to see the dress. The dress is part of it, sure. But we'll also need to do something about that plain Jane makeup and hairdo. This is gonna take some work. Ouch! Well, I'll see you later, Cloud. Peek, and I'll poke out your eyes. I thought I told you. No peeking. You have a lot of nerve. How old are you? I thought I told you. No peeking. said you. Let me see if I've got this straight. You ditched your lady friend and fellow champion to have a boys night out in Wall Market? Uh. Kidding. If I know the madam, and I do, this was all, I can see why. There's no denying you're skilled with a sword. Ain't nothing wrong with that. But then there's nothing wrong with expanding your horizon. Knowing the ways of this here world will help you to better protect you while you're in it. Reckon I got a few solid gigs for you. Huh. <laughs> That's the spirit. You have yourself a grand time tonight. Oh, 
All we gotta do is steer clear of the shady areas. I saw the new... Been waiting for you to show up. Thanks for coming. Jules, head trainer. If you've got some time to spare, how about a little bit of fun? Wanna try taking on one of our guys? <laughs> You're not serious, are you? Look at him! He's a scrawny little Now now. <laughs> what do you say, Cloud? If you want to give it a go, just let me know. So Ha! You're taking you got no idea. All right. We'll settle this to try to now. Let's all see what you've got. No way I'm letting you win. for helping me teach my boys at the cloud. We're all one big... If you're ever up for training, our door... <laughs> if you're ever in the mood for another workout, just gotta to say, you. the boys really like having you around. You here to test your muscular metal against mine? You ready to do this? Yeah. Not bad at all. I knew you could do it. You got this. Come on. That's how it's yeah. done. Your form's looking good. You got this. Come on. Not bad yeah. at all. That's how it's done. I knew yeah. you could do it. Not bad at all. Now it's done. Your form's looking good. You've got yeah. this. Come on. Not bad at all. I knew you could do it. That's how it's done. Your form's looking good. Not bad at all. I knew you could do it. That's how it's done. You've got yeah. this. Come on. I knew you could do it. Not bad at all. Your form's looking good. That's how it's done. You've got this. Come on. Not bad at all. Your form's looking good. I knew you could do it! That's how it's done! Not bad at all! You've got yeah. this! Come on! 
Your form's looking good. <sighs> that it? I'm impressed. I am awesome. You want to go, do you? All right, then, bring it on. You can back out if you're scared. Ah. Yeah. Not bad at all. <laughs> you can do better than that. Ah, ah shit! <laughs> That's how it's done. <laughs> I do. Okay, <laughs> done. Let me see you sweat. You've got ah. this. Come on. Your form's looking uh, good. That's how it's done. I knew uh, you could do it. Uh, Come on. I know you've got uh, more to get. I knew you could do it. Your form's uh, looking good. You've got this. Come on. That's what you two are doing. Awesome. Not bad at all. Your form's looking good. You've got this. Come on. I yeah. Feel the burn. Not bad at all. Your form's looking good. That's how it's done. You have faith in you guys! Not bad at all! Your form's good! I knew you could do it! That's what you two are doing! Awesome! Your form's looking good! I knew you could do it! You got this! Come on! Come on! I know you got more to do you can do it! Your form's looking good! That's how it's done! No! That was easy! You did it! You really beat me! You gotta be in incredible shape! <laughs> it's unfair that you did What do you say? May I have this? <laughs> you up for some exercise? Okay, let's have some fun. Okay. I think you got that limp now, Jules? <laughs> you up for some exercise? I hope you're all warmed up. <gasps> you are kidding! <laughs> oh shit! <sighs> You can do it, Jules! We're rooting for you! So much training do you do? Who'd have thought it'd be this close? You can't get enough of those beautiful muscles! Poetry in motion! I believe in you! Woo! I can hear your muscles crying out! You are in the zone! So much training do you do? Who'd have thought it'd be this close? Slow and steady. One, two, one, two. You are in the zone. I'm going to head the game. Yeah. 
Who'd have thought it'd be this close? Poetry in motion. I don't know how you can recover from that one. You're better than I Come on, you can win this! <laughs> you gotta loosen up. You're way too dense. Let's you and me work up a sweat. Okay, let's have some fun. This close. I believe yeah. in you. You are in the zone. You're the old man. Who's gonna win this yeah. one? It's too close to tell. How much training do you do? Who'd have thought yeah. it'd be this close? Yeah. Oh, damn. Find me for a rematch. I'll never say no to a friendly competition. I won't go easy on you. Oh, look at that! We're really you can't take the pressure! How much training do you do? You are in the zone! I can't get enough of those beautiful muscles! Poetry in motion! I believe in you! You are in the zone! You're better than I thought! Who's gonna win this Who'd one? Yeah. Be this Who's close. How much <laughs> training do you do? Woo! Yeah, yeah Jules, show that fifty how it's done. Who'd have yeah. thought it'd be this close? How much <laughs> training do you do? You are yeah. in the zone. <laughs> You're better than I thought. Oh, yeah. oh man, who's gonna win this <laughs> one? It's too close to yeah. hell. I believe in you. You <laughs> are in the zone. <laughs> Slow and steady. One, Woo! two, one, <laughs> two. Poetry and <laughs> motion. How much training do you do? I can hear your muscles crying out in your yeah. pain! Yeah. <laughs> I'm a trainer. Of course I know a thing or two. <laughs> you up for some exercise? Okay, let's have some fun. You are in the zone! I believe in you! Poetry in motion! You can't get enough of those beautiful people! Come on, you can win this! Woo! Yeah. You think you got that wimp now, 
Up. You're way too dead. Let's you and me work up a sweat. I hope you're all warmed up. idea how strong you really were. Listen up, everyone. We can be stronger, better. Let's hit those weights. You got it, Jules. Anything in particular you're looking for? Oh, you must be the Merc I've been here? His drunk ass has been at the bar for hours now. He's probably three sheets in over at Drunkers. Until I see Wait up, Cloud! Sam caught me up on everything. He said, and to do that, you're trying to learn all about Walmart. Bro, I know this town now. Let's the bars this way. Drunkards, here we come. The Drunkard's Den, the best place in Walmart. To it's mostly the same folks every night, so. Oh, can't just waltz in there uninvited. Listen, there are rules for this. Hey, old dude! Huh? Son, is that you? 
Did you always look so moronic? Well, right back at you. Yeah, whatever. We're here to take you back to the store. I'm not going back. Not ever. My life is ruined. It's over. Come on, there's no... Really? See, I may... And so I had no choice but to steal my... Your precious insp... Who with the... Inspiration! Got it. I mean, I just need to get you... Leave it to me, old dude. Uh, hey, aren't you... That's about if I win, you join me for a drink. And if I... This is my chance. Just one. The more you been inside now that I think about it. Know how people hey wait for me hmm? so and what do you do uh, 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 inspiration but I didn't take it I want it fair. well that's true but I tell you what uh, what you something only uh. I need you to go and get me something from the vending machine at the end no I don't the sauce stop saying the sauce the time has come. For me to wield my powers of assessment. I can feel it. Oh, -ho, mm -hmm. I can feel it. I'm in for one wild run. <laughs> I'm gonna see some weird shit tonight. Step right up, yeah. step right up. It's the fully automated, state-of-the-art item procurement machine. One more round, one more round. I have the perfect room for the both of you. Just... Hey, are you really leaving me out here? You need me. You need my knowledge and expertise to unlock... That's it. It looks like a... <laughs> you ready for... All right. This... Where? Well... I can't tell. You just need to tap into your knowledge and expert, and then you'll be able. I don't need to whip it out. I've done this before. Watch this. Whoa! Look at you, bro. Huh? Is this the sauce? I don't know. Come on, bro. You know there are more hidden buttons waiting to be pushed. Oh, so this is the sauce. Neato. It, it's time. The last. Before someone sees you are the grand prize. <laughs> Whatever. We got what we came here for. Let's get out of here and head to the. Uh, what do you mean? Really <laughs> <laughs> Let's show him what we brought back hmm? from our... Oh, it's time, bro. The sauce. Could it be? Oh, it... It's just sauce. Don't sell yourself short. <laughs> Damn, bro. All that's right. why you're such an awesome... Hey, shitting me? Nope. So, as I recall, the guy who runs... Ugh. Well, that's the... Hey. If you're done here, next, huh? then get going on it. Getting kind of hungry, actually. How oh, not? I think it's coming from over there. Nope. Uh, Stay focused. We have work to do first.
Welcome. Well, sorry, we're not here to eat. Materia guy? Let me ask you something. Nope, never cooked. That's too bad. I've narrowed it down to... Man, I seriously have... I've got it. The problem is the heat. Oh? Know a little something about fire. Well, will you look at that? Works fine. Here. Man, this looks great. What a shame. He seemed to be enjoying me. So maybe next time. Any oh, and here's a voucher with my apologies. Oh, get the poor guy. I need all the drugs right now. Out of the way. Out of the them two at a time way. and their flavor will change. <laughs> 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 huh? You know this guy? Well. Oh, that about you you got there? Should have said something sooner. Come on in. What is it with today? People are drunk. Besides this dumbass? Ah, loads of them. I got enough outstanding orders to... Ugh. Eh, I can't very well leave... Hey, you're not doing much. Maybe... You're what? Then you must know... You're a lifesaver. Literally. Yeah. You'll probably Easy to find this guy sprawled out on the ground somewhere. But make sure you check his symptoms. If I had to guess where a sick person would end up, I'd say the toilet. Start maybe ones in the shops nearby?
Got meds. Let me take a look at you. Thanks, buddy. Oh, you saved my life. Here, it's not much, but no. I'm grateful for your help. But... Should probably head back. About as much as Thanks I for the help. Anyway, I promised to be worth. What is it? Well, it belonged to the owner of the clothing store. Heard from the cook. Wait, we have. Oh shit! Bingo! You see, we get together for a game. This found its way in. It's a VIP call. Not having it. Oh mother, of... bro! We gotta get to the. Tell the old man I said hi. Ah. Hey, old dude, we're back! Huh? Who are you? You're no son of mine, I think. Special delivery, just for you. Ho oh, ho! My inspiration! You've returned to me at long last! Yo, is that what I think it is? Oh, you bet it is! And it was hard won! I sewed dresses day and night for those ladies until I got what I was after. A honeybee in VIP card! I... Now make way for the VIP, boys. I don't... But first, I should pick up... Lead the way, old dude. We are... Well, can't imagine what you- Hey, you're coming, right? Get ready for a- I'm done with this. I get it, bro. Uh. It's a pity you're not gonna join us, but I swear to you, bro, as an asp- I'm gonna go in there and get as much inspiration because Cloud, honeybee in, inspiration! <laughs> <sighs> Couldn't agree more. Should probably go see Sam again.
Hey, been waiting for you. So, what are you in the mood to fight? Come back anytime you want to fight. Okay, choose an opponent to fight. Come back anytime you want to fight.
can't have just one. Really mm -hmm. So, tell me, would you bet it was an eye opening? Nothing I haven't seen before. Not exactly. I got one more. What's your angle? <laughs> Just get your ass to the Coliseum. You'll see. Come on, you guys. We've been waiting for you, Chip. Stands are packed thanks to you. Now get out there and give them a show. Lovers of bloodshed and mayhem, your favorite champion, Cloud, is back in the ring. Right now, this boy may be hot, hot, hot. But look out, folks, because these dynamite challengers may just blow the champ clean off his throne. I hope you brought shades because you're about to see some fireworks. Fighters, begin!
Shell herself, huh? The girl keeps in shape. And boy, does it shuffle. Hey. Just making an observation, that's all. Anyway, seems like you're serious about getting the poor girl out of her predicament. I could tell easy enough by the way you fought back there. Cut to the chase. Never said I would. Pop plus. As you are now, I reckon you could ride to her rescue without it. You've changed since you first rolled into this here town. At any rate, I've said all of them. Your lady friend ought to be done changing by now. She ain't no Tifa, but she is a firecracker. Keep her waiting too long and she might just blow up in your face. Okay, choose an opponent to fight. Come back anytime you want to fight. Take a deep breath. What about Tifa? I heard Corneo was gonna audition new girls soon. And Tifa's... Tifa's gonna be... I just... I, I don't know... Well, I do. I'll come too! Hey, Cloud! Bro, I can call you bro, right? Nope. J 
just want to say, bro, that I'm totally relieved that you're looking out for Tifa. So, like, how'd you get so strong anyway, bro? I said. The way you fight, bro, is like poetry and violence. Bam, bam, whoosh, whoosh, you know? I really wish I could be just like you. My problem is that I tend to overthink and overanalyze everything. So, bro, do you have any advice? Well, this is it for me. Call me crazy, but, uh, I have a feeling that I'll... Yes, sir. You again? Got a letter of approval right here. Hmm? You know that's only good for women, right? Yeah, it's for Aerith. Who? Uh, well, either way, you're stuck out here, pal. I, I wasn't asking for permission. Huh? Wouldn't try it if I were you. Trust me, you don't want to screw with the Don. If you even think about causing any trouble, he'll make sure someone pays for it. And that someone might wind up being the girl you're trying so hard to break. Or it could wind up being someone you've never even met before. Get it? You're in the Don's world now. Anyway, you've got some time yet. The audition. If you're sure you want to go through with this, then bring the girl. But if I were you, I would. is so gaudy and impossible to move in. Uh, uh, yeah. Loud? Uh, excuse me. Huh. Hey, wait a minute. Did Johnny forget to give you my message? The one asking me to stay put? No, I got it. I was worried about you. I'm starting to think this place is more dangerous than we thought. Who knows what they'll ask you to do in this audition. No way in hell I'll let you go in there by- By myself? Oh, don't worry. Come on. You'll see. See what, exactly? According to Madam M, you've caught the eye of a certain fabulous sum- Huh? Look at you, all dolled up and fabulous. Where are you headed? Well, what do we have here? You're quite the pretty little lady. <sighs> She's not bad at all. Honeybee Inn's Andrea Rodea and convince him to give you his stamp of approval. You said you didn't want me going alone, right? Well, with Andrea's help, you can join me. It'll be fun. And honestly, I think you'll look pretty cute in a dress. What? 
It's pretty rare for Andrea to take a personal interest in someone. At least, that's what Madame M said. Trust me, this is gonna work out great. Uh... Come on! Don't you wanna see- Wait. No can do, Cloud. This is our plan, and you'll learn to love it. <laughs> 